want aggressive shake in cap cut. What's up guys and again welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you how to make aggressive shake in CapCut. This video is going to help CapCut users so without wasting any more of your time let's get started. So first of all open your CapCut application and yes guys I'm using CapCut Pro right now. If you want you can download from my telegram channel. Back to the topic firstly you have to add your clips and your clips must have to speed ramping. After speed ramping I'm gonna do zoom in. Now you have to add zoom in every clip as I did. Now click here and go to the camera section and add right effect. Now go to the video effect section and then opening and closing and add a bleak blur. duplicate five times. Again, duplicate two times. Now again go to the video effect section and then nightclub. And add shake effect. And spread it throughout the video. Now again add shake effect. Duplicate of shake. Again, duplicate of shake. Now click on clip, then animation section, and click on swing bottom right. Tell me 
Now add a black overlay. Distance should be kept 0.3 second. Now duplicate the black overlay. Now change the distance to 0.4 second. Now add a white overlay and distance should be 0.4 second. And take it a little bit beyond the beat mark. Now again duplicate of white overlay. And your aggressive shake will be ready. For motion blur, open node video and import your edit clip here. Now click here and click on time interpretation and then optical flow and copy my settings. Now your motion blur is ready. Okay, so today you've learned how to make aggressive shake in CapCut, but if you want to make more aggressive shake, check out the video on the left side where I show you how to make direction blow hard shake. And in the video on the right side, I explained how to make Xeno like CC in a light motion. That's it for today's video. So this was Xenox signing off. See you guys in the next one. Till end. Peace.